Hello, I'm, I'm going to build an electric bicycle. The idea is to scrounge uh, lead acid batteries that were thrown out for recycling, restore them. That'll be my first power source until I can afford a better battery pack. And um, I'm going to do a Bafang 8 Fun 36 volt, 350 watt mid drive uh, electric bike conversion kit on a 26 inch mountain bike. I got the mountain bike at a thrift store for 40 bucks a couple of years ago. I put one of those cheapo uh, gas engine kits from China on it and it never really worked. So now I'm going to do electric and I'm doing it all on the cheap except for the kit which was $430 uh, with the shipping and everything included. Um, and I really don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to be making mistakes as I go along, and you guys get to watch, I guess, because if, if I remember, I'll put this on YouTube and then make another and another and another. I'm homesick today, so <coughs> it's, the, it's a good time. It's a good time to do it. Um, yeah, so here's the, uh, oh, wait a minute, I can, I'm on my iPhone here. Here's the workbench where I've been doing it, and uh, you can see I have, these are 7 amp hour uh, sealed lead acid batteries. I get these for free from work in the recycling bin, and a lot of them turned out to actually be bad, but many, many, many of them turn out to just need a little bit of water and uh, a little desulfation and accept a full charge. Um, so that's one pack, 36 volt, 7 amp hour. Uh, here are the new batteries I just got. These gold tops I like because they are usually the newest. Um, this one's from 2012. Most of the others say that they're from 2009 or 2008. Yeah, 09, that one. You can see them bubbling away. Bubble, bubble, bubble. So, those are charging. It's working great. It's a desulfating intelligent charger. Um, right now it's testing the batteries, uh, which is a good sign. It usually does that and uh, throws in a reverse pulse, I think is what it's called, desulfation uh, thing until it can accept a charge. Most of them turn out okay. I don't actually understand what's going on. Here are the batteries I have yet to crack open. Uh, yeah, and you super glue the tops back on. Works out great. Okay, now I'm in the other room. Uh, yeah, light's working. So this just came in the mail today. This is going to be the bag. It's a shoulder bag that straps onto a bike rack and it's going to hold the batteries. You're going to see me do all that. Here's the other, here's my best pack right now. Um, that's the one that takes the longest to deplete and, and I've, I have an inverter and I use, I use it to drain the batteries to test how long it takes. And the, the, actually the capacity is pretty good. Here's the unit. It just came in the mail yesterday. I haven't really messed with it too much. Uh, that's the motor unit. Eight fun. So this is a mid-drive. This means I'm going to get to use my gears and climb those hills on the way to work. Uh, I'm not going to do an unboxing or anything. There's tons of them on YouTube. You're going to see me install the thing. I took it apart. I hooked everything up. Plugged it into the batteries. Watched the motor spin. I'm satisfied. So yeah. Um... Tomorrow I'm probably going to go to work. I, I don't really have an excuse to stay home anymore. The chest con congestion is clearing up and the muscle achiness is starting to heal. And I figure tomorrow um, I can just sweat out the rest of it. And then on the way home from work I will drop the, um, the mountain bike wheels off at the shop to be trued up. Because that kit was terrible. You have to like bolt a, a gear wheel onto the spokes and it oh god so I'm gonna get the mountain bike in shape I'll, I'll show you that I guess tomorrow okay 
stick with me, I'm sure, I mean, this is like probably one of my first YouTube videos, so stick with me, huh?